everyone. So I'm going to be looking at my top box for May. I do have a gift subscription where like I get like no kind of communication with and then um, a monthly subscription. I did kind of do the yearly last year and kind of repeated it um, this year. They, their priv boxes have like, I think only the last couple of months have they done it. Um, but not really something that I was like interested in. Um, cause I think like you got like one product of like an eyelash serum and like last time I got an eyelash serum and still four other samples in a box. I was like, Meh. um, I'm going into my box things are a little bit different so I'm excited for that because the last time um so my April to January have kind of been the same boxes which is a little bit like womp 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 so going into it um Noxin? Noxin? um you have their instant fullness dry cleanser it's kind of like your dry shampoo so let's see if it will give me some volume uh, I'm so bad for like you probably want to hold back a little too I probably go in a little too close but it does have like a nice kind of minty smell I feel like all shampoos kind of give you a little bit of grit that helps you get a little bit of like oomph to your hair. Um, my hair is kind of clean, so it's hard to kind of tell. Uh, not too bad for a white cast kind of running my fingers through. Like I do feel some of that. Like I can feel, uh, I want to say like it's like a cornstarchy kind of feeling, but putting my bandana back in, <laughs> headband, oh my goodness. Um, so I got 43.3 grams, so I always do like my little dry shampoos. Um from Mana Kadar, um, you have their lip gloss. So I feel like I already have this. Uh, not too bad. I don't think they're too badly priced either. Um, from Dulce, I have their Boombastic um, Volumizing Mascara. So it is plastic bristles just kind of a straight brush I don't want to open it because I have already got one from be a bombshell I have their Dublin eyeshadow so you get four little eyeshadows oh god please don't break uh so you get like a four little eyeshadow quad which I don't mind. Like I like you have let kind of one look, a green look. I wish this was in there like March one, because then it's like perfect for kind of like St. Patty's Day. Because I kind of have bluey green eyes, um, it does work nicely. So I'll do a separate video kind of going over how I like this. Going in to my other box. So I did get, again, the dry shampoo, which let's kind of feel, but like, it, like you don't see a white cast, so that's not too bad. The grit will kind of help give you some volume. Um, I did get Bella Puri Cosmetic, their HG setting spray, so I feel like, oh god. I've gotten it before. I don't know if we can kind of see, but like 
that's not something you want for a setting spray. So the mister on this is horrible. I feel like someone spat at my face. Like that's not what you want. To just kind of show you a difference. Sorry. Um, going with my Urban Decay, right? So kind of spraying. Like, can we see that difference? Like, you can't even see it. I just got hit by a water gun. So, really sometimes, yeah, the delivery method on this, like, I would normally say when you first spray a product, you want to be careful not to spray your face, and I'm always bad for that, but it stays just like... Like, I don't want it to feel like it's spitting on my face. Like, I feel like I have a drip. Um, from Mana Kadar, you have their gel liner. So it's almost like a kitten liner. So just a black little liner. I would say, like, I would have kind of gotten rid of it. Because um, I have enough black liners. But the tip hit the inside so it's kind of damaged so I wouldn't try and sell it or like give it away just because people would be like ew you might have touched it uh which isn't the case so I will kind of just keep it let's just kind of go through and see we'll test it out it pops it's a little bit like not so dark applying it to my waterline so it's not very like black but you can get a nice thin line I almost don't mind it not being like pitch black and it's kind of like a sheer black you can kind of build it up so nice easy to use so better than what I thought and then I think I almost forgot my last product in my second box was bombshell um, eyeshadow palette and it's a different one so I'm so glad they did not give me the same one and it is kind of like a cool tone palette so that is kind of nice um, having some cooler shades so I do like that they're not like kind of like typical like just standard there's some nice colors in there so we'll try in a separate video doing a makeup look with both but overall I am happy with my top box this one um, definitely doing better than some things like Ipsy that just sent today and we're on like the 19th the 18th of May already and I'm like oh my god I'm not gonna get it until June so I guess because of where I am in the GTA um, it does ship fast um, for me like normally I'll get my box and then the spoiler of like what's coming in your box email comes after um, which is okay because I rather get the products before the email so I do appreciate like the fast delivery because they generally ship around the 15th of the month. Um, and being kind of like Canadian, they're a little bit faster of a shipping. So if you're looking kind of for a Canadian beauty subscription, it's not a bad, bad one to get. So thanks so much for watching guys. I hope you have a great day. Bye. Sorry of the hiccups. <laughs>